Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and today we have another humble bundle of interest to game developers and graphic artists in general. This one is the Ultimate 3D Creators Bundle. It is a weird collection of stuff. Uh, basically, it's three different creators together. We've got Action VFX, we have Matte Paint, and then I believe it is Double Jump for some training materials here. So you got a mix of 3D models, HDRIs, as well as training courses, mostly around Unreal Engine and Houdini. I've been meaning to learn Houdini for ages. It's sort of like my... Uh, big white whale that keeps getting away. But as you can see here, you're getting a collection of HDRI maps. I'll explain exactly what the heck that means in just a second, as well as um, 3D models, mostly around a military theme, but we also got a bit of generalized aviation here as well. So you got things like Black Hawk helicopters, F-16s, Bell helicopters, and then a 747 for good measure. Again, some training materials in here and HDRI maps. So here you can see one of the examples. This is an F-16 fighter that I downloaded. Um, I've done something wrong with the texture mapping because it's it's um, upside down or something to that effect. I've screwed up the textures on it, uh, but you're getting a very, very, very high resolution here and you're getting a ton of different options when it comes to the maps. And when I mean a ton, I mean a ton. So you see here the example that we're looking at right now. This is the OBJ format version of it. You can download these in multiple different formats. I'll show you that in just a minute. So you're getting it, uh, the uh, file itself, 74 megabytes in size. And then on top of that, you're getting textures in both uh, specular and gloss formats or PBR or specifically for Unreal Engine. And then inside of each one of these texture maps, what you're seeing here is you're getting multiple different sets. So you get the set 001 uh, through five. So five different sets of textures here. And then in this case, it's Unreal Engine setup. So you're getting the base map, the occlusion roughness and orm map all or, or metallic map all is one, normal base color, etc. You also again have um, a, a roughness metallic type setup for if you're using a PBR approach. Here you're getting the base color normal maps uh, as well as ambient occlusion, metalness, etc. And you're getting very high resolution maps in this case. So uh, that is the one aspect of it. The other aspect is this pack right here. And this is a bunch of HDRs, both in 2 and 4K and sometimes even up to 8K. So what is exactly is an HDRI map? Well, it is basically a panoramic image. And I'll show you that here we've got it in Blender in the background there. That is an HDRI map. And you can use it to uh, light the scene or affect how lighting works on the scene. So for example, here we can change the strength of it like so. Uh, and we've got a variety of different maps here. So I could go ahead and select out a different map here like so. There is a different one and a different one again. Now the cool thing here is they can actually be used in a variety of different ways. So for example, here we are in the Godot game engine. And here you can see again, our model with my uh, screwed up texturing once again. So obviously you can use these assets in a variety of different game engines. Uh, the fact that you're getting raw assets here, you can use them in whatever setup you wish. In this particular case, I actually took it into Blender, exported it out as a GLB. That is why the texture maps are consistently screwed up. So again, I screwed them up here. Might as well keep it consistent. And we also see we have an HDRI map. Using an HDRI map, almost every single game engine supports it. Once again, uh, I have set that up as the sky in my world. So when the sky intensity changes, or when I set up the uh, environment map here for that guy, so what you'll see here is sky is set up, and I set it up as a panoramic sky material, and then you basically just drop the, uh, the map in to that location. Ooh, that was a bug. All right, let's open that back up again, open that back up again. So we want that map to go to that location here. So there you see, slightly different HDRI map. We got a few different options here. Nothing uh, profoundly different, but you can see how they change the lighting in the world. So working with them is quite simple. Basically in Godot, do a world environment, set up your sky as the sky in the background here and set it in there. By the way, you can also change how much influence the HDRI map has on your world. So it's a way of doing uh, just nice ambient environments and so on. You can also turn it off so it doesn't render. So it's basically just giving the lighting from it, uh, but it doesn't show up in the background. So as you can see, usable in multiple different game engines. Let's head on back over to the bundle itself. So what are you getting here? You're getting, uh, again, HDRI maps, 3D models, and training material. The training stuff is all on the Teachable platform. Uh, it's organized into tiers. You buy a higher value tier, you get all the stuff below it. So what you're seeing here is the 35 items are for $30 USD. I'm not going to go through the particulars of all of these things. You'll note here we got a median price tier, and then we have the uh, $1 tier here. At the $1 tier, you're getting um, uh, just back. Basically, these are just images, by the way. So look for the ones that say uh, HDRI maps. Those are the 3D environments. These are literally just background images. Um, 
and you're getting the uh, first week course for the Houdini bundle. We move up to the median tier. That's where you start getting the HDRIs. Those are those panoramic or 3D textures that you can use as backgrounds in your rendering or your games, as well as a number of more image packs as well, uh, and a couple more models, uh, including an Abrams tank, a bunch of different fighter jets and helicopters, etc. And then the full fat tier you're getting again, even more uh, model stuff. Plus, you can also get a $290 active artist subscription here on Matte Paint, Matte Paint, which gives you unlimited access to their vast library of high resolution digital assets tailored for creative professionals in raw in EXR format. So if you like what you see for the HDRI maps uh, and so on, you can get a one year subscription to their site. Uh, this stuff is redeemed on the three different sites, by the way. Uh, so you'll have to create an, a, um, an account on each. Here we can see, for example, Action VFX. This is what it looks like. So once you go to my downloads after you've redeemed it, uh, you, by the way, there's three redemption codes for Action VFX. A little bit annoying, but uh, you can deal with it. So you got a model that you like, basically go ahead and pick it. So here, for example, are we have our F-15. And you'll notice here, if I click here, we can get it in uh, LOD level zero, so full detail uh, for Maya, FBX, and OBJ format. That should get you into pretty much everything you need. They're static meshes. They have no animations or anything. So uh, using them in OBJ, no problem at all. Well, they do have cockpit animations, you can see there, but uh, um, that's it. Uh, next up, we have the map paint. Uh, here you redeem using a key, uh, enter your key in, and you get all of those various different assets available. You can see, for example, your HDRI maps. This one is gigantic, so this is 16K, probably overkill, but you're also getting an 8K format of that one if, in the lower tier. Uh, but if you want, uh, these will be available as EXR files, also a low resolution JPEG that comes with them as well. Also in that third tier, there is an option here for a one year artist plus subscription to the matte paint service in general. Uh, so that could be a value to you if you found those maps useful. And then the final part here is the training stuff for um, from Double Jump Academy. Uh, this again is mostly around Houdini for Unreal Engine. So I've redeemed it. This is the Teachable site. So if you ever used Teachable before, uh, this is what Game Dev TV at least used to be on. It's got persistence, it's got tracking and so on. So come into a category here, for example, you will see uh, the course there, uh, any details, and then when you're done it, you click and done. It's pretty simple. They've, they've done pretty bare bones with what they've done here, uh, and so on. And they've plus they've got a number of their talks linked in here as well. So if you're looking at learning uh, Houdini, uh, could be a good pickup for you. Again, uh, it's my uh, great white whale or big white whale or whatever Moby Dick was hunting for all of his time. I've never been able to learn Houdini. It's just like this one insanely confusing software package to me, but it's super powerful. Uh, and then in terms of one question people often have, and I will link these in the linked article down below, a uh, direct link to the licensing. Uh, so for the action VFX, you're getting individual licenses. Uh, so that would give you this level right here. Uh, this is ideal for freelancer, hobbyists, and students, but it's one of those things you definitely want to be aware of if you are working in a studio, uh, unless you're going to be kind of in your own little bubble, this may not be ideal for you because you can't put it on a shared drive with other people. Uh, you have to work on it by yourself, etc. So if you're working on a team of people and multiple people are going to be working with this asset, each one is going to need their own license. Other than that, you can use them commercially, etc. cetera. Uh, do make sure to check out this before you get into that. So this is for the 3D models. Uh, for the HDRI stuff here, uh, all the details are available here in the license uh, and you can jump into that. There's, there's a lot here, so I'm not... I'm not going through all that. It's one of those things you want to be aware of, but that is the license. I will have that linked down below. I know that's an area of interest, and I'll try to point that out in Humble Bundles. Whenever I can publicly surface the licenses to you guys, I will do so. So these licenses are available in the linked article down below. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. That is the, what is the wording here? The Ultimate 3D Creators Bundle. So you're getting 3D assets, HDRI maps, um, basically general just images, up to a one-year subscription to that site, uh, as well as training materials uh, primarily for Houdini. But as you saw, there's actually some other stuff thrown in there as well. Um, so three different uh, Houdini cases courses in there. I've been meaning to learn Houdini forever, so I may actually run through those. It's an interesting bundle. Again, a bit of an eclectic mix, uh, but I'd be interested in hearing what you think of it. Uh, that is the ultimate 3D creators bundle. And as you saw, easily used in whatever game engine you could desire. Uh, also, you're getting raw assets in Maya format. So if you're using Maya, uh, even better. So let me know what you think. Comments down below. Talk to you all later. Goodbye.